Sometimes when you move to another part of the country, you bring some of your furnishings with you and it just doesn't go. I have this Victorian chest, cedar chest, that is so practical for storage, but it just doesn't go with my coastal decor. So my very Victorian cedar chest is gonna need a very coastal makeover. It's time to take this chest from Victorian to coastal. First thing I'm gonna do is take off this hardware, figure out how to take off that hardware and take off the bottom. And since I'm gonna spray paint all of it, I'm going to take off the top right away too. I wanted to add something coastal and then I thought I would like to personalize it. This is what I came up with. Schmidt's Crab Shack and I used a royalty free image for the crab and Florida established 2016 because that's the year we bought our house. So what I did is I printed it out on regular copy paper on my laser printer and I reverse the image because I want the writing to go in the right direction and all I have to do is brush the photo transfer medium onto the front of the image and put it on here and rub it down with like a credit card or anything you might have, a burnishing tool, and we'll put it on there and let it dry for 12 hours. Okay, then I'm gonna take it up. Okay, I'm gonna place this on here. We get it straight. Use a credit card. To smooth it and get any bubbles out so that the image actually will make contact. I think we're pretty good. And I have a damp paper towel to wipe off any of this excess around it. Not on the paper. And we'll let it dry for 12 hours. This has dried and now I'm just gonna wet it with a paper towel. What we're hoping to do is just rub off that outer layer and leave the transfer in place. So we're just rubbing off that excess paper. And if a little extra rubs off, it gives it a little bit of a worn look, which I like. And 
then I'm going to do a clear coat over this whole thing. And it rubbed off in certain spots, which I liked because it gives it a little bit of a worn look to it, a little bit distressed. So I'm totally cool with that. I was hoping it would do that. So we will let this dry. You guys, it's all finished. Can you believe it? Here it is. You remember how it started? It was this dark Victorian piece. My parents had given it to me forever ago and I loved it at the time, but times have changed. We have moved and I needed something coastal and I wanted to keep it because it was a quality piece, but it just didn't go with my decor. So a little Rust-Oleum chalk paint, the transfer, I was able to personalize it, change out the handles. The paint went on beautifully. Inside out, I kept the cedar to keep the bugs away. Totally functional. Getting rid of that trim, putting on some paint and a couple of minor changes. And look, it's beautiful. I really believe that you guys can change just about any piece of furniture to go with your decor. Let me know how you like it down in the comments below. So I'll definitely see you next time. You guys remember, life's too short not to shimmer. So grab your glue gun and your glitter. Stay safe. Bye guys. <music>